A 40-minute drive southwest of the island's capital, Manama, the Kingdom of Bahrain brought Formula One to the Middle East for the first time in 2004. Built on the site of an old camel farm in Sakir, the Bahrain International Circuit is home to 50,000 grandstand seats and five track layouts with a special endurance circuit used for the opening race of the 2010 season, won by Fernando Alonso in his first race for Ferrari. But 2014 saw temperatures drop as the event became a night race and crowds witnessed a famous desert duel under the floodlights between Mercedes teammates Nico Rosberg and Lewis Hamilton. It's definitely the most exciting race um, I've ever done in my whole career. I was on the, on the knife edge the whole time. Regardless of the time of day, drivers have to contend with crosswinds and a slippery surface due to sand blowing onto the circuit and the track's blend of technical corners and frequent acceleration zones means rear tyres especially can take a pummeling. Many cars have expired in the unrelenting heat, with the 2005 race recorded as one of the hottest in history. A tricky infield section challenges drivers. Turns 9 and 10 see them simultaneously turn, brake and downshift as they scrub off speed for the tight left-hand hairpin. Cars are on full throttle for two-thirds of the lap and brake wear is high, with the biggest stops coming at turns 1 and 14. Turn 1 is named after the seven-time world champion Michael Schumacher, who dominated the inaugural race here, taking pole position, victory and the fastest lap. Pole isn't everything in Bahrain though. The race has been won five times out of ten from P1, but there are plenty of chances to overtake, particularly under braking into turns 1 and 4. Fernando Alonso won from fourth on the grid in 2006, narrowly avoiding a spinning Felipe Massa before going on to win for Renault. Red Bull, Mercedes and Braun have also triumphed here, while McLaren hold the lap record through Pedro de la Rosa, set while the Spaniard was deputising for the injured Juan Pablo Montoya in 2005. As the wind picks up each evening and the early sunset takes hold, the place has a magical Arabian Nights feel to it. As the light fades, the adrenaline rises when Formula One's finest drivers get set to do battle under the lights in the desert night.